Good afternoon, Railbirds. This is your host, Quasi Pro, and today my special guest is two-time bracelet winner, J.P. Kelly. Thanks for joining us, uh, J.P. No worries. Uh, how would you summarize your day so far? Uh, level two was quite good, and then that level was just terrible. But I still got 25K. It's fine. It's all right. Uh, what about your table draw? Is, uh, has it been a good draw for you, or has it been a, some tricky opponents? Um, it's been a really good table, I think. Uh, it's just sometimes you can't force the action. It's a ten-handed game. Uh, the main event's seven, eight-day tournament. It's not. Uh, you, you can't force it in the first day. If you finish the day with 50,000, that's fine. So uh, I'm just going to pick some spots in the next, uh, next couple of levels that are left. Uh, you're a rising superstar with two bracelets under your belt already in a relatively short amount of time. Uh, what do you attribute to s uh, such a successful run at an early age? Um, I don't know. I'm always learning. I always try and uh, improve. Um, uh, this this uh, World Series actually hasn't been the best of series for me, but i um, still like, looking forward to the main event. I'm still like fighting to win and trying to uh, do as well as possible. Okay. Uh, most of your experience is in uh, No Limit and Pot Limit Hold'em, but you also have some caches in Omaha events. Is there any particular uh, poker discipline that you want to dominate next, or are you perfectly happy to specialize in one area? Uh, well, actually, it's more Omaha caches is my specialist area, I'd say. Um, um, I mean, I guess I could learn mixed games. Um, uh, the games aren't as great on like online now as well. The Americans can't play. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I'm quite happy. I'm, I don't think I've uh, mastered anything yet. I'm still learning, still trying to improve and still trying to play well. There's so many good players out there. You can't get complacent, otherwise uh, they'll, like, eat you alive. Uh, speaking of Black Friday, is, has the competition online uh, uh, been, been uh, easier for you? Well, yeah, it was. Uh, I haven't played for the last seven weeks because I've been out here, but uh, before then it was. I, I think it's definitely got easier. I think the, the best... Uh, regular players or uh, Americans, in my opinion. So, um, yeah, I think it's definitely got easier. Great. Um, and finally, uh, just a quick uh, advice question here. Uh, what, would you, what advice would you give a novice player who struggles to keep their emotions in check after a bad beat to keep them from, from tilting? Just remember it happens to everyone. Um, so if you think that, like, you're not the only one that's got it. Everyone else has got their own stories. And if you tilt off every time you get a bad beat, then you're never going to win a tournament. You just have to put it behind you and just get on with the next hand. Okay, JP, I appreciate uh, you taking the time to talk with us today, and uh, good luck to you and the rest of the series. Thanks a lot.